Remember when I talked about the M41D and how it was one of the worst tanks in the game, if not the worst? If you want the worst ATGM carrier in the game, look no further than the Type 60. It is hard to describe how bad this vehicle is. The main problem is the missiles, obviously. They are incredibly slow. Like, you see how long it took to fly? Just that short distance. They are manual command line of sight, so that means you have to use WASD to guide them. And not only that, but they have this weird arcing trajectory that you have to account for when you fire them. Like, you see how long it takes to fly? But the way they're mounted really messes them up, because there's like a minimum engagement distance. Like, if you're too close to it, you can't guide it in time to hit. Like, I, you see, I'm, I'm holding down on the missile guidance, and I can't hit the IT-1. It's basically a Japanese variant of the M113 in terms of its performance, so it's not very good. I... This is one of the few vehicles that I am negative in, in War Thunder, as far as KD goes. So, uh, why not torture myself for entertainment? Because apparently that worked pretty well last time. So I think what we're going to do is set up behind one of these rocks. That way we can expose as little of ourselves as possible. Oh my god. <laughs> it's so slow, it's so bad. Oh my god. Okay, I'm still guiding the missile, apparently. Like, that martyr didn't react quickly at all, and he was still able to dodge the missile very easily. Because this, this thing flies at 85 meters per second. Which is incredibly slow. Well, this is not a good position to be in. Oh, he's absolutely gonna kill us. I haven't used mouse aim missiles in a while, so I'm sorry if this is, like, hard to watch. Oh my god. Oh, we got him! Whoa! We got him! What? Maybe we can kill this... I think that's an M41? Um... Assuming he doesn't see us? He looks pretty distracted, but I don't know if I can arc... I don't think I can arc the missile in time. Oh, yeah, I can't even... It doesn't even let me... Did I just hit a friendly plane <laughs> with the missile? <laughs> what happened? I, I deserve that. I deserve that wholeheartedly. What? What happened? I tried to make the missile hit the ground so I could fire faster, and I hit a friendly plane. Hold on, I need to- we need to check the replay. Did I hit it directly, or did, did it, like, hit the ground and that somehow killed the plane? What? It didn't hit him. How did that kill him? What? How? What? How did that? It's 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 a shaped charge that was aiming down. This game is great at finding new ways to make me feel like I'm losing my mind. Even at 6.7, this thing is just... I think regardless of where you put it, it's not going to be good. Like, it simply does not work within the confines of War Thunder. Oh. There's an M48, and... I... Yeah. I'm not going to get a single kill this game, am I? It's sad that getting one kill in the first match is... <laughs> is considered, like, setting my expectations too high. I'm surprised that we killed that dude. And that my launchers didn't blow up. These things are such a pain to guide. Like, if I had to guess, I think this thing is a minimum engagement distance of like 100 meters or something. It's ridiculous. 
very cool. Come on, guide. What? <laughs> it takes so long for guidance to take over. It's crazy. Oh, we got, we got a double kill. I have to be careful here. Oh, there's someone right next to me. I gotta run. Goodbye. I do not want to contend with you. I can't. <laughs> I don't have an option. Oh, that's something I didn't know. Apparently, he can just machine gun my missiles. <laughs> how? How is he not dead? What? It's okay, guys. We've got scouting, though. It's fine. That was... Sto... <laughs> That was so stupid, oh my god. That is incredibly cool. What is up with that dude's textures? He, he, he has an unpainted model kit. It's just completely gray. I don't think I can kill that KV-2. I think he's too close. I think I can kill this ASU, though. What? <laughs> Where did my missile go? Hello, missile? I'm firing javelins right now. What? <laughs> Apparently, I have to be on level ground. Otherwise, it just sends them into orbit. God, I actually have to expose my entire vehicle. And it didn't even one-shot him. He can still kill me. It missed. It went too high. He's gonna kill me. He's actually... Oh, nope. <laughs> this is ridiculous. Oh, this is an awful map for the Type 60. Like, there are long sight lines on this map, but there are so many obstacles that people can just duck behind. Oh god, there's already a life... It's a PT! Remember in the Puma video when I said that I was playing an FPS and the tanks I was fighting were playing survival horror? I am now on the survival horror side. I got him! <laughs> I got him. Oh my god. I'm sorry, but get absolutely clowned on. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's, uh, that's enough for me. Uh, if you're thinking about playing the, the Type 60, just don't. Just play literally any other vehicle. I guess it can be used as a backup in some, like, very niche circumstances, but I really wouldn't recommend it. Anyway, hope you guys enjoyed the video, and I'll see you on the next one.